what's up guys it's Mac welcome back to the channel today we have a special unboxing uh, this package came all the way from France uh, inside is the uh, Libre Mejo inside uh, book that has 20 years of his artwork and I believe stories in there so we're gonna go ahead and get this thing unboxed see what it's looking like like I said this box is from France it has a little bit of damage as you can see and it doesn't look to be in that great a condition so Hopefully everything on the inside is good, so let's go ahead and get it opened up and see what it's like. All right, guys, so we're gonna go ahead and get this thing opened up. So you can see up close that, you know, the box is in pretty bad shape. It's got a few breaks here in the back. Uh, you can hear the book kind of rattling around in there. Uh, hopefully that's uh, okay. You got a break here, another break here, and looks like it's, uh, open right here as well so hopefully this thing is uh okay i don't even think it matters how we kind of go into this thing Let's go ahead and get into it this way so yeah the book is just kind of loosely just in here and yeah that's pretty crappy the way that they shipped it it's got damage up front right here there's damage right here oh man so yeah guys this is uh why you don't buy stuff from other countries maybe <laughs> So like I stated, uh, there's some damage here, uh, damage on the back. It was protected, but you know, there's a dent here, damage here, and damage here. So yeah, other than that, I mean, the book still looks pretty good. So let's go ahead and go and get an overhead view of uh, the opening and everything. All right, guys. So here's the book overhead spine in the back of the book overall, overall execution of the book is really nice it's just that it didn't of course come in all that uh, great condition so um, this book is written in or is dubbed in French or however you want to say that, I don't read French, so I wanted to pick this up just because I'm a big fan of Libre Mejo's artwork. It's got a little bit of a, I think a forward in here from Brian Azzarello as well. Just kind of goes through. So I think I'm gonna wait, um, and I am planned on picking up the um, English version when they release it as well. Just kind of wanted to get this because I was hoping that it being the uh, original version that was released, uh, it would be nice to have in the uh, collection here. So hopefully it being, having the, you know, it being somewhat damaged is not going to, you know, diminish uh, the collectability or value of the book, but I have a feeling I'm gonna have a hard time getting uh, it uh, shipped back and getting a return or a, I guess a refund on this book just because of where it came all the way from France. So I paid about uh, $65 for this book and then it was like, I think about 30 bucks to get it shipped to the United States. So not all that bad when you think about it. As far as the book and all but it's got some very cool artwork um, Lee Bermejo like I stated if I stated before is one of my favorite artists um, and I think this book is a must-have for a Bermejo fan
So yeah, look, tell me what you guys think uh, about this book in the comment section below. If you guys plan on picking it up, if you picked up the version here like I did, that's from France. Is it uh, Joker? Clip out. Looks awesome. And uh, yeah, if you guys are planning on picking up the um, American or English version when it comes out, and what you think I should do about this book, should I at least try to reach out to uh, where I picked it up from and try to get a uh, another book, or should I just just accept it the way it is? I mean, the internals are all fine, just the outside of the book. Uh, is beat up. Man, look at that little artwork. Love this style. But yeah, um, I um, first came about knowing this book on Instagram uh, following Lee Bermejo. And he... Um, had a post out about this book uh, coming together and it was going to be coming out in October. So I knew immediately at that point that uh, I wanted to try to source this out and find it. And I am overall happy that I have it, of course, but kind of wish it would have come in better condition. So I'm going to just continue flipping through this book here. So you guys can check that out. I'll stop rambling and I'll come back at the end of the video.
So I hope you guys enjoyed that little flip through. That was 324 pages of all things Lee Bermejo. I purchased this book directly through Urban Comics. Urban Comics and Lee Bermejo worked together to publish this book. I don't know if I can recommend actually going through Urban Comics to pick this book up because you can see that's how they shipped it. It doesn't really come in quality shipping. I don't know why they would make a book or ship a book this expensive and put it in a box with no other protectant besides what you saw. So on a positive note, I think the book is executed very well. Like I stated before, one of my favorite things about the book is the back gallery where it showcases some of the artwork from Lieber Mayo from in the past. Um, I think that's a really cool touch. And I'm a pretty big DC Black Label fan. I have many DC Black Label um, single issues uh, in my comic collection. So I'll go ahead and grab a couple of those out that pertain to Lee Bermejo, and then we'll go ahead and wrap this up. So I pulled out some of my single issues of DC Black Label uh, collection. I have the entire run of uh, Batman Damned um, in these single issues. Um, so I definitely recommend uh, checking it out if you haven't read it before. Um, if you like to collect uh, collected editions, you can get this uh, hardcover edition, which has the complete story in it, which I recommend this as well. Uh, very good price on these. Most of the time, I think you can find it for around twenty to twenty-five dollars. So, um, I definitely recommend picking up this Libra Mayo Inside book. I think that uh, overall, it's a very nice book. I just wish that, uh, of course, my copy wouldn't have came damaged. Uh, but uh, if you are planning on picking it up, I would wait until the uh, U.S. version comes out. That way, you don't have to go through what I went through. I'm fine being the guinea pig. Uh, for everybody else um, so don't order this thing from out of the United States or you may have an issue like I did so I appreciate you guys taking the time to watch don't forget to hit me with a like on the way out and if you're new to the channel please consider subscribing I try to drop different types of content on this channel and hopefully you guys uh, appreciate that I will see you guys in the next video peace